Hello everyone, good morning. This is me, Manya Gupta, your tech host. Bulletin of the day starts with Apple's global manufacturing shifts. India, Vietnam, US, they are the new focus. Andhra Pradesh signs deal for India's first quantum valley in Amravati. Firefox new move, Google search revenue share at the center of DOG antitrust remedies. Apple shares fall amidst tariff costs and economic woes. Try Chief calls for a new framework amid digital growth. Apple teams up with Anthropic to develop AI-powered coding platform. And finally, about Elon Musk who responds to Tesla CEO transition rumor. So in yesterday's quiz, we asked you what is the full form of URL? Answer is Uniform Resource Locator. It's time for our daily tech question. Here's the one today. What will be the full form of VPN? Confident you got the answer? Drop your guess in the comments below. Tune into tomorrow's bulletin to find out if you nailed it. Moving on with our news, Apple has revealed a massive shift in its global manufacturing strategy focusing on regions like India, US and Vietnam to diversify its production. As the company continues to face ongoing trade tensions between China and US, CEO Team Cook confirmed that Apple is moving a significant portion of its production outside of China, which has been its manufacturing base for years. The company has already ramped up production in India, where Foxconn, Apple's primary manufacturing partner, is investing heavily in the new plants. Vietnam has also become a key player in Apple's strategy with more suppliers shifting operations there to reduce reliance on the Chinese manufacturing. The decision to diversify is part of Apple's long-term strategy to future-proof its supply chain and avoid being vulnerable to the geopolitical risks which are happening now. While China will remain an important part of Apple's production, the company's decision to expand into India and other countries is a clear sign that the tech giant is adapting to the changing global landscape with the geopolitical things going on and it is working hard to remain competitive in an unpredictable world. Moving on in a major leap towards quantum technology, Indian state of Andhra Pradesh, they have signed an agreement to establish country's first quantum valley in Amaravati. New hub will focus on quantum computing, quantum communication, quantum cryptography, positioning India to become a leader in the emerging field of quantum technology. Ambitious project aims to attract global experts and tech firms to collaborate on quantum research and development. So it is expected to become a hotspot for innovation and startups in quantum related fields with the long-term goals to bolster India's position in global tech leadership. Announcement comes at a time when countries like US, China, Russia, they are racing to develop quantum capabilities which could revolutionize industries, ranging from cyber security to the pharmaceuticals. By investing in quantum technology now, India hopes to secure a foothold in this rapidly advancing sector. If successful, the quantum valley could be a game changer for the country's technological and economic future. In a significant development, the US Department of Justice, DOJ, is pushing for a change in business relationship between Mozilla Firefox browser and Google. A major point of contention is Google's role as the default search engine on Firefox and the massive revenue share Google pays Mozilla for it. As part of DOJ's ongoing antitrust investigation with Google market dominance, focus is now on whether this deal stifles competition and harms users by making Google the automatic choice for millions. Reports suggest that DOJ may want to impose changes on how Google and Firefox collaborate, potentially breaking up such lucrative agreements. This could pave the way for competitors like Microsoft Bing or even DuckDuckGo to get a foothold as a default search engine. Mozilla, however, argues that this revenue share is necessary to maintain independent development of Firefox, which relies on the funds to stay afloat in a market which is dominated by tech giants. Well, let me tell you now that shares of Apple took a hit after analyst list reported that the company's profit margins are being squeezed by increased tariff costs and other economic challenges. So in a recent article, it was revealed that the company known for its high-end gadgets like iPhone, it is feeling pressure from rising manufacturing costs, especially those related to tariffs on Chinese imports. While Apple has managed to weather economic slowdowns in the past, these new developments, they are adding a layer of uncertainty to the tech giant's financial outlook. Experts are concerned that the higher cost of production could translate to increased prices for consumers, which might deter potential buyers also. Additionally, there is a mounting pressure to diversify supply chains and move more production out of China. 
which is a complicated shift that could take years to fully get absorbed and implemented. As the digital media landscape continues to evolve, Telecom Regulatory Authority of India, TRI, is calling for a new framework to address the growing influence of digital content. What is it? In a recent statement, TRI Chairman P.D. Vagela pointed out that one TV rating agency is no longer sufficient to capture the diversity and scale of the digital consumption in India. With the rise of OTT platforms, social media, other online content providers, traditional TV rating systems, they are struggling to keep up. Try believes that the new metrics and methodologies are required to assess the influence of digital content accurately. This will not only help regulators and advertisers make informed decisions, but they will also provide better insights into digital consumption trends. In a bold step towards expanding its AI portfolio, Apple is partnering with Anthropic, an emerging AI startup. Goal is to develop an AI-powered coding platform that could transform the way software is written. According to a report, this collaboration is a part of Apple's broader strategy to incorporate AI technology into its developer ecosystem, making tools smarter, more efficient for coders and software engineers. The new platform will leverage Anthropic's cutting-edge AI models, which are designed to assist developers by automatically writing, debugging, optimizing code based on user inputs. Now, this could dramatically reduce the time developers spend on repetitive tasks and lower the barrier for the newcomers to learn code. Last but not the least, amid swirling rumors about future at Tesla, Elon Musk took to Twitter to clarify reports that he might step down as CEO of electric car giant. In a cryptic tweet, Musk denied the rumors, stating that he had no intention of leaving this role. However, he did hint that there could be changes in leadership positions at Tesla in the future suggesting that while he would remain involved in the company, it might be in a different capacity. So these remarks came after news broke that Tesla's stock has been affected a lot by investor concerns about Musk growing responsibility at SpaceX and other ventures like Twitter and Neuralink. As Tesla CEO, Musk has overseen companies' meteoric rise and EV market, but as his attention splits across multiple projects, questions about his leadership and company's future direction have emerged. Musk's response has done little to the quell speculation, but his influence on Tesla remains undeniable. Fans, investors alike will continue to keep a close watch on this leadership changes so that they won't lose money. This was all for today's bulletin. I'll again meet you tomorrow with the next one. Till then, stay safe. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe IT Voice for all the tech updates.